Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to create square videos in PowerPoint 2016. The square video is going to look something like this. So I've got PowerPoint open here. It's the latest Office 365 version. The first thing we need to do is go to the Design tab and under Customize, click on Slide Size. You will see these three options. Choose Customize Slide Size and you will see this dialog box pop up. We need to change the width and the height settings. The dimensions that we're going to be using are 1080 by 1080 pixels, which is 1 to 1 aspect ratio. So just type in 1080px in the width box, and then click in the height box. PowerPoint automatically does the conversion. As you can see, 1080 pixels equals 11.25 inches. Similarly, type 1080px in the height box and use the tab key on your keyboard. We have now set the dimensions for the square video. Finally, click OK. You will then see this dialog box. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to go with Ensure Fit. As you can see, the slide size has been adjusted to a square. Next, let's duplicate the slide. To do so, right-click on the slide in the left side panel and choose Duplicate Slide. I will repeat this process and create a total of five slides. Now it will depend what content and animations you want to use on each slide. So I've gone ahead and created some slides with images and quotes. For example, on this first slide, I have a background image, a transparent shape, and a text box. So let me show you what animations and transitions I've used. In the Animations tab, I'll open the animation pane. We will see the animations that I've used. For the image background, I apply the grow and shrink animation. For the transparent shape, I apply the zoom animation. And for the text box, I've applied the basic zoom animation. So here is a preview of the animation for this first slide. And I will play the whole video at the end of this video. Also, if you want to download this project file, you will find the link in the description section. For the transitions, I apply the fade transition to all the slides. You can also add audio or music in the Insert tab under the Media section. Click on the Audio button and choose Audio on my PC. Choose your MP3 file and click Insert. If you want the music to play for the entire video, go to the Playback tab and in the Audio Styles section, choose Play in Background. You can also fade the music in the Editing section if you wish. Finally, click the File menu to render the MP4 video. Click on Export and then click on Create a Video. Check your video settings. Click Create Video. Give it a file name and click Save. You will see a rendering progress bar at the bottom, and here is how the video came out.